assalamu alaikum students i hope you are doing good we are studying a course organic polymer and the topic which is under studied is synthetic polymer we will discuss a last example of the synthetic polymer is polyamide and it is an important topic we will discuss the example in polyamide in form of nylon 6 and nylon 66 first of all we will discuss its introduction polyamide may be produced by the interaction of amine ns2 group and carboxyl group through condensation process students what is condensation process a process in which release of small molecule take place so two interactions take place one interactions by amine from one units another interaction carboxyl from another units when both monomeric units come in contact a condensation process take place and they will polymerize to form a polymer second point is normally aliphatic polyamides are known as nylon and commercially important nylon are nylon 6 nylon 66 nylon 610 and nylon 11 these are the examples which we we have prepared commercially the first number indicate the number of carbon atoms present in the diamine monomer and second from the acid students here as above we notice that nylon 66 so it's an important mcq use this 6 came from which unit another 6 came from which unit so this line the first number indicates the number of carbon atoms present in the diamine monomer first number is came from the diamine monomer and second six which is second number from acid now we will move towards its preparation first of all we will prepare a nylon 6 this nylon 6 mainly 60% used to make fiber nylon 6 can be prepared from amino caproic acid another name of the amino caproic acid is glycine here is the glycine or amino caproic acid here is methylene group five time present it is a chain carbon chain in which at one terminal ns2 amine group is present another terminal position a carboxylic is present carboxylic acid is present overall name is glycine or amino caproic acid it will undergo to polymerization and which polymerization is self polymerization mean h from this amine part and oh from this acid part it will release in the form of water here is the release of water molecule and the remaining species which is said to be nylon 6 it will undergo to self condensation and polymerize to form a polymer name polyamide or name special name is the nylon 6 in which amide linkage take place here is the carbon nitrogen this chain is take place second is nylon 6 can be prepared from the caprolactam via ring opening this is a caprolactam and as we already studied that for the ring opening process we need to be a initiator here is initiator maybe as a water we need high temperature a vacuum these initiator and these initial conditions is required for ring opening when this initiator attack on this bond carbon and nitrogen bond 
and this bond will break between this carbonyl carbon and a mild linkage nh and this ring will be open to form a linear structure and form a polyamide name nylon 6 so there is there are two reactions through which we can prepare a nylon 6 second example is nylon 66 the preparation of nylon 66 the two monomer is present for the production of nylon 66 one is the adipic acid another is hexamethylene diamine when they polymerize condense to form a nylon 66 here is a adipic acid this methylene group four time present and in this chain at the both end terminal this carboxylic group is present and the overall name said to be adipic acid here is a hexamethylene di amine this is another unit it will undergo to condensation process here h from this amine and oh from this acid when it will release to form water molecule and this carbonyl bond carbonyl carbon a bond will take place between this amide linkage nh here is a amide linkage carbon nitrogen bond and this polymer is said to be polyamide amide linkage take place and special name is nylon 66 so students here its uses sorry it is used as plastic and fiber textile dresses nylon umbrella nylon parachute and seat belt etc this was overall about our selected topic about the polyamide i hope you understand this lecture you gathered some new information here kindly share your feedback thank you